Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this matchup in the Axis Football League. My name is Dave Stevens, along with my partner, Mike Steele. Dave, I won't lie. I didn't do a lot of research this week. Manning's Tavern has been running great wing specials. I'm going to lean on your expertise and apologize to the fans. I may need to take a few breaks in the action. Yeah, Mike, I think we've seen this before. Well, let's play some football. The kicker kicks it away. Summer catches the kickoff. Makes the return up to the 19. He steps back to pass. That brings up second down. He steps back to pass. The home team will fake the handoff and look to pass. And he's brought down. Go! Hurls a pass way down the right side of the field. And that's enough for a first down. That play really caught the defense off guard. I'm not sure what they were expecting there on first down, but it wasn't that. A fresh set of downs for the offense. <laughs> Number 17, handing it off. Second and short. He drops back. Grabbed out of the air. He's brought down. That will bring up first down. The home team lining up with two receivers. Go! He sheds off the defender. That will bring up second down. Number 17 steps back into the pocket. Third and long. The number 17 drops back. He can't bring it in. The home team is set to try for a field goal. Here's the kick. And it's good. The home team draws first blood today. Three, nothing. The home team takes the first lead of the game with that field goal. The home team out to kick off. 
Number 16, boots it. Number 5, takes the kicker. Tackled after a return of 13. The away team has a great opportunity to get back out in front of this ball game on this drive. He drops back, hurls a pass, and he misses his mark. Second down. the handoff to number 47 a penalty flag on the field let's see what the call on the field is the home team will accept the penalty it's a common misconception that blockers are allowed to grab defenders as long as their hands are on the inside that's what we saw there but it's still a holding penalty Number four kicks this one away. Summer takes the kickoff. Takes the return up to the 32. The offense can make this a two-score game with a nice drive and finish here. Let's see if they can execute. Setting up shop from the 32. Drops back into the pocket. Tosses a pass. Breaking away from the defense. Tackled by number nothing. A penalty marker on the play. Let's see how the penalty affects things. The home team will accept the penalty. Penalties have a way of taking the air out of a team's confidence or momentum. Number 23 on the carry. A successful rushing attack makes the defense pull that eighth man into the box, which then opens up the passing game. He drops back to pass. Finds a target. Incomplete. <laughs> Fakes the handoff. Incomplete. Down. He drops back. The wide receiver catches it. Penalty marker on the field. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The home team will accept the penalty. Traditional wisdom puts the blame for penalties on the coaches.
Number 17, back to pass. Incomplete. Second and goal. Number 17 steps back into the pocket. Snagged out of the air by number 10. That gets us to third down. The tight end lines up on the right side. Number 17, dropping back. He makes the catch in the end zone for a touchdown. That was a great short strike into the end zone for the touchdown. The home team lines up for the PAT. Hike. The kicker makes the kick. It's good. The home team adds to their score. 12 nothing. And now, Dave, the backups are kind of begging for some game time. Number 16 kicks it deep. Number 5 takes the kick. Makes the return up to the 20-yard line. So much of football is mental. The offense needs to get a score in this drive to build some confidence if they want any shot of coming back in this game. A fresh set of downs for the offense. <laughs> Number seven hands it off. Second down. All right. Handing it off to number one. That will bring up third down. Third and short. He tosses it to the runner. Finally taken down by number two. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Another first down, Dave. I tell you, this sets up the play action so well. From under center. Tonight. will bring up second down. There's a penalty marker on the field. The home team accepts the penalty. Even as a quarterback, you ask these guys to hold their water during all these audibles and movement. It can't always happen. Second down. Then hike. Makes the catch. The quarterback steps back into the pocket. The running back makes the catch. First down. The away team lines up with two backs in the backfield. Drop 
stepping back. And he can't reel it in. Lining up with two backs. Passes one to the back. The runner shakes off the tackle. That will move the chains. That signals the end of the first quarter. The home team leading 12-0. A fresh set of downs for the offense. Number one takes the carry. He steps in for six. The defense has to do a better job of pursuing down the field to cut that run off. With where they were positioned, there's no reason the runner should have scored on that play. Number four makes the kick. It's good. The away team eats away at the lead a bit. 12-7. The away team pulls it to a one-possession game with that score. Number four kicks a deep one into the end zone. Summer takes the kick. Tackled after a return of 16. The home team can make this a two-score game with a nice drive and finish here. Let's see if they can execute. The home team looking to get things going from the 19-yard line. He drops back. The receiver can't bring it in. The QB drops back. The home team with the play action. And he's forced out up at the 27. That will bring up third down. The home team lines up with one back in the backfield. Pitches it out to number 23. Sometimes it's a good strategy to play the field position game. Get yards when you can and hope for a good stop on defense so you can give it another go closer to the end zone. Tonight. He punts it away. Barrett catches the punt. Makes the return up to the 32-yard line. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. He hands it to number one. Second down. He sets up and throws past the first down. Tackled. That will move the chains. Coming out in the gun. Number one on the run. 
Second down. Pitches the ball out to the runner. He breaks the tackle. And that's enough for a first down. The away team lines up with two backs in the backfield. Number seven, looking to pass. Throws a pass. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. Go. He drops back to pass. Launches a pass deep over the top of the middle of the field. It's not always the wide open guys you throw to. The later in the progression you get, the more you've got to thread the needle. The away team lining up with two receivers. Hike. He hands it to number one. He scores! A penalty flag on the field. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The away team chooses to decline the penalty. The offensive line did a great job creating a huge surge off the snap. That allowed the runner to shoot right into the end zone for the touchdown. There's the kick. It's good. The away team will take the lead with that score. 14, 12. The fans are starting to get into it, Dave. They know that we've got a great game today. Number four sends it off. The kick is caught at the three-yard line. The home team has to feel good about where they are. They're down by a single score and are in control of what happens next. Go. He drops back. He tosses one to the left side. The ball falls to the ground incomplete. Second down. Tonight. The QB makes the toss. Third down. Third down and short. He tosses one across the first down line. That'll bring up fourth down. That throw shows a great deal of confidence in his receiver. Hike. Number nine, punts it away. Barrett catches the punt. Makes the return up to the 31-yard line. This drive coming up is a good chance for the offense to give themselves a bit of breathing room. This drive will begin from the 32-yard line. Tonight. He hands it to number one. That will bring up second down. Second down. Go! 
Number one takes the handoff. That'll be enough for the first down. Another first down, Dave. I tell you, this sets up the play action so well. Let's see what they do on first down. Go! The quarterback gives it away. That'll be enough for the first down. Those D linemen are lobbying for holding, hoping the refs can stop the momentum this offense is building. First down. The quarterback steps back into the pocket. A flag on the play. Incomplete. Let's see how the penalty affects things. The home team takes the penalty. There was some contact there, but I think there may have been a bit of exaggeration by the receiver. He steps back to pass. Finds a target out to the sideline. That brings up second down. A single back set for the away team. The quarterback makes the pitch. Tackled near the line, back at the 47-yard line. That gets us to third down. Let's see what the call is on third down. Number seven, looking to pass. That'll be enough for the first down. Tosses a pass, makes the reception. Lining up on second down. He snags it out of the air for the touchdown. Great move by the receiver to shake off his defender and grab the short touchdown pass. The away team lines up for the PAT. Here's the kick. And it's good. The away team adds to their score. 21-12. That's a big score for the away team. Number four, kicks a deep one into the end zone. The kick is caught at the two-yard line. Makes the return up to the 21. Overall today, they've been outperformed on offense. It's time for them to buckle down and get things moving if they want any chance of turning things around. The home team begins the drive from the 22-yard line. He drops back to pass. Steps into the pocket. He sends one. And it's off.
The quarterback dropping back. And that's enough for a first down. with number eight. Let's see what they do on first down. Tonight. The quarterback dropping back. And they can't connect incomplete. I'm watching the wideout come back in motion that it wasn't on target. You can't always blame the QB, son. Second down. Tonight. Finds a target. He snags it out of the air for the touchdown. Huge credit goes to the blockers on that touchdown. That really paved the way right into the end zone. They're getting set for the point after. Tonight. The kick is up. And it's good. The home team reclaims some lost ground. 21-19. The home team makes this a one-possession game. The kick's away. Taken at the one-yard line. Makes the return up to the 22. This drive coming up is a good chance for the offense to give themselves a bit of breathing room. They'll start things off from the 23-yard line. Go. The QB drops back. Caught by number 8. That will move the chains. That'll wrap things up for the second quarter. The away team with the lead so far, 21-19. Number 16 boots it. Number 5 takes the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 16. Let's head down to Emma Adams on the field. Emma, what can you tell us? Gentlemen, I had a chance to discuss the first half with the coach for the home team. To quote him directly, he said his team's defensive performance in the first half was bad. That was the only word he was willing to say, and the numbers don't lie. He isn't often a man of few words, so his silence on his team's defensive performance speaks volumes. Back to you. We appreciate the update, Emma. The away team comes out with a single back. The quarterback looking to pass. Number seven fakes the handoff and looks to pass. Incomplete. That's the right call in that situation. The defense is stacked against the pass and is hoping the offense wants to take a deep shot to try and pick up the first down. The away team is set to kick this one away. The punt's away. The kick is caught at the 31. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. 
This drive will begin from the 39-yard line. Steps into the pocket. Throws. Connects with number 38. Second down. Number 23 on the carry. That will bring up third down. Third down and short. He flings a pass up beyond the first down. That will bring up first down. These catches in traffic are so hard to complete because as a receiver, you know you're going to get popped hard. A fresh set of downs for the offense. He hands it to the runner. That brings up second down. Fifth play of the drive for the home team. Hike. He takes the ball. That gets us to third down. First down. Hike. Allen makes the sack. The offense will lose about. 11, second down. Second down and long. Hike. Quarterback to pass. Douglas brings him down in the backfield. Loss of 13, third down. Ninth play of the drive for the home team. Go. He steps back to pass. Throws a pass deep down the field. And he's taken down. From under center. Quarterback to pass, the offense with the play action. That will bring up second down. Just a single back in the backfield for the home team. Tosses a screen pass up the middle. That gets us to third down. As a coach, you always want a quarterback to be able to zip it into tight windows like that to put pressure on the defense.
The home team is set to try for a short field goal here. Here's the kick. And it's good, <laughs> but I'll tell you, not by much. <laughs> the home team pulls ahead, 22-21. Elite teams don't give up leads, Dave. If the defense wants to establish itself as a contender in the Axis League, then they need to get it together. The kicker sends this one deep. The return man catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 20. The away team has a great opportunity to get back out in front of this ball game on this drive. The away team looking to get things going from the 20-yard line. Tonight. The running back takes the handoff. That gets us to second down. Second play of the drive. Tonight. The quarterback drops back. He hurls one. Incomplete. Number seven, dropping back, throws deep down the field. And he's brought down by number three. That'll be enough for the first down. Fourth play of the drive. Number seven makes the handoff. That gets us to second down. <laughs> Number seven hands it off. Third down. Tonight. Hands it to number 23. The away team is set to kick this one away. Tonight. Number two punts it away. The punt will sail out of bounds. The home team has a one possession lead going into the drive. Let's see what they can do with it. There's a flag on the field. And he safely steps out. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The home team accepts the penalty. You can bump the receiver for five yards, but the defender has got to let them go after that. <laughs> the QB makes the toss eventually dragged down up at the 21 that will bring up first down the QB back to pass he makes the throw and he stopped that'll bring up a fresh set of downs this is not the type of offense you want to hand momentum like this to. 
They have some real threats on the field. The third quarter comes to a close. The home team with the edge so far, 22-21. First down. Tonight. Steps into the pocket. Finds a target. And that's enough for a first down. That's the kind of talent this team has, Dave. Moving the ball at will against a defense that isn't full of slouches. <laughs> Number 36 takes the ball. Second down. Second down. Go! Number 17 makes the handoff. Steps into the pocket, finds a target, and he stopped. Good enough for a first down. The defense has to rally after that. You can give up a big play, that's gonna happen, but don't let this turn into a momentum builder. Hike. Number 17, pitching it out. Second down. Second down. Go! Number 23 takes the ball. Third down. A crucial third down for the offense. Finds a target. It's caught in the end zone. Touchdown. This is big boy football. The defense might consider getting some new guys in because they just got manhandled. The home team sets up shot for the extra point. The kick is made. And it's good. The home team widens their lead, 29-21. So it's back to the defense, Dave. The offense has proven again it can put up points. Number 16 sends this one into the end zone. Number 5 takes the kick. Makes the return up to the 15-yard line. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. The away team begins the drive from the 16-yard line. Go! He shakes off the tackle. That will bring up first down. Another first down, Dave. I tell you, this sets up the play action so well. Uh 
Number seven gives it away. Tackled quickly up at the 29, second down. He drops back. The ball is out. He's brought down. Sometimes holding it high and tight isn't even enough. You have to clamp down on the ball or expect to put it on the turf now and then. If the offense can get another score on this drive here, it will really put the pressure on. Number 17 with the handoff. Stopped before he could break loose. That brings up second down. He tosses one across the first down line. That gets us to third down. <laughs> he takes the ball. There is a flag on the play. Let's see how the penalty affects things. The home team takes the penalty. Traditional wisdom puts the blame for penalties on the coaches. Tight end on the right side. Number 20, and he crosses the goal line for a touchdown. Sometimes these goal line runs are about patience and waiting for gaps to develop, and sometimes it's about hitting the hole as fast as you can. They're getting set for the point after. There is a flag on the play. The home team takes the penalty. If the coach hasn't created a culture where penalties are not acceptable, then players won't take that extra effort to avoid making them. The home team lines up for the PAT. <laughs> Number 16 makes the kick, and it's good! The home team extends their lead, 36-21. And now, Dave, the backups are kind of begging for some game time. Here comes the kicking team. Number 16 kicks a deep one into the end zone. Number 5 catches the kickoff. Tackled after a return of 20. The away team has dug themselves into quite a hole here. They've got a chance to regain some of that on this drive. First and ten. Go! The running back on the carry. Second down. near the line that brings up third down Hike. he flings a pass first down
The away team lines up with one back in the backfield. He hands it to the runner. Second down. Second down and short. Number seven steps back into the pocket. And it's off. He tosses one, and it's off. The QB took a deep shot there for the first down, but the defense had it covered the whole way. Hike! The ball falls to the ground, incomplete. After a failed attempt like that, you tend to second-guess yourself as a coach. Should we have kicked there? That decision may haunt them for a while. They'll start things off from the 39. Number 23 on the carry. The away team will call their first time out here. It's almost like he can walk these first downs. I'm looking for a personnel change on this defense. The home team with a single back in the backfield. He breaks free. And he's tackled up near the line by number nothing. That will bring up second down. <laughs> number 17, handing it off. The away team uses their second timeout. The home team with a single back in the backfield. Number 17 with the handoff. The away team uses their last timeout. That brings up fourth down. The field goal unit makes its way up to the line. It's up. And it barely squeezes in there. That's good from 32 yards out. The home team adds to their score. 39-21. The away team needs to respond to that score quickly to get the momentum going on their side. The kick is off. Number five takes the kick. Tackled after a return of 21. The offense has a great opportunity here to build some momentum and eat away at that lead they're facing. Hike. Incomplete pass. it 
and X with number five. Good enough for a first down. A fresh set of downs for the offense. He makes the throw. Tackled by number 25. The offense is giving the chain gain a workout down there. They were barely set before needing to move. He tosses one to the left side of the field. And they can't connect incomplete. Number seven, back to pass, and he can't reel it in. Let's see what the call is on third down. The quarterback, back to pass, launches a pass way down the middle of the field, and he can't reel it in. Even though that pass was incomplete, those are the types of throws that stretch a defense. The D was up to the challenge that time. Height. Steps into the pocket. Number five makes the reception. Second down. Third down. A lot of great performances today, Mike. Who do you have as the stud of the game? I'm going to go with number 17 for the home team. What an impact he had today. 